Hey everyone, so today we are going to be doing a pro standard tutorial on this type of card layout with the music player. So we are just going to go ahead and get started. So this is the music player we're going to be using, and I didn't want to re-upload it on my pasty bin, especially because there's only three things that um, need to be changed. So firstly, the positioning. This is what works on my device. It may be different on yours, but here are the settings. And then obviously the music player doesn't have any color right now, so it'll show up as black. So we obviously want to change that too. So you're going to make this white. And then in the reference card, the outline is gray. So I use this color code. And then obviously we're going to want to add this song link. I'll have a link in the description to the website I use to download my songs. I upload them to Dropbox and then I copy the link and you're going to paste it not where it says audio ID. I know that's kind of confusing. I put it there by accident at first, but in between the quotation marks after SRC, like so, and change www to DL. And at the end, add .mp3 and your song should play.
Okay, so now I'm going to try and quickly go over what is customizable about the code because obviously you're going to want to change the colors and whatnot to fit the theme that you're doing. So firstly, for the name text, you're obviously you might want to change the gradient. So that's text number one. So you would do that here. You can change the colors, add more colors, delete colors, yada, yada, yada. And as for the containers, it's the same thing where it says background gradient, that is obviously the circle gradient, the radial gradient, and so you can change the colors for that. And it's, the containers are all separate, so if I made them all the same color, but if you wanna do it like in the reference card where each container is a different color, you can do so, you would just change the colors. Here, I am not entirely sure how the um, percentages work. I just copied a code from somewhere, so you can mess around with those as you like but just be aware that that might change like how it looks i'm not sure entirely how but you know and the marks at the very bottom are gonna be th these right here like within the scroll boxes and so obviously you would change again the colors and the gradient here they're also separate if you want to make each like highlight in each scroll box a different color so really most of the things you're changing are the gradient colors so easier way to find them if you're working on laptop is to just search gradient and then you can change the colors as so obviously not the scroll bar colors but once you get to like text one and the element ids that should be it as obviously these right here you just change in the card itself and yeah, that's about it. The music player, again, the positioning might need to be adjusted for that. And the container is already adjusted. This container, the first container, is already adjusted for mobile here. But again, I might have a different like mobile device, a different phone than you, so that might need to be adjusted as well. So you can mess around with the positioning there until it looks right. All right, and yeah, this should be what your final product looks like. As usual, if you need any help or have any questions, please let me do know down below. The actual card making is pretty simple as most of it is done within the code, within the embed. Um, but yeah, let me know if you have any questions. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate all the support as well as whoever requested this tutorial. And I will, of course, as usual again, see you all in the next one. Have a great day. Bye-bye.